Good morning, Keller Williams, and welcome to day 21 of the Command 66 Day Challenge. Marty Miller with Summit Property Group in Houston, Texas. Kind of a bittersweet day today, guys, and I just wanted to um, take a quick moment to really say thank you, as all of us I have over the last um, 12 to 14 hours, to Diana Kokoska for such an amazing career at Keller Williams with her um, leadership and her just um, undying commitment to the MAPS program and bold and touching, changing, just creating so many amazing lives and so many amazing opportunities. And so um, I don't know if Diana watches these challenges and yet Diana, if you do, thank you from all of us um, here at KW. We are so excited to see about all of your new opportunities and I'd love getting to see you and Tony present at uh, Family Reunion. You both looked extremely happy and I can imagine that happiness only continues. So thank you, Diana. Today's challenge, we are going to get into opportunities again. We're going to get into the sales pipeline and we're going to show you some exciting stuff. So from within a sales pipeline in the past, we showed you what it looked like to get an offer on one of your listings. So right now within my active pipeline, let's do a quick refresh and get those guys to show up. We had the uh, test listing, right? This was our seller listing. Previously, I'd shown you what it looked like to get multiple offers on that listing. So if we click on offers, let's do a little refresh, get those offers to show up. There you go. Um, it showed that I had two offers, right? And we were looking at those. Um, one of them was 290,000. One of them was 300,000. You can see the cash breakdown, what was being financed, earnest amounts, option fees, close dates, and the option period. And we're going to go in and, whoops. See, I was playing around earlier, so we're not going to accept that one yet. Um, we like this offer better, and our clients like it better, and we recommended it, and they're like, yep, we're going to go ahead and take it. We're going to move forward. So if you have no further negotiations and everything looks good, you can actually come within the offers submenu and click on accept. When you click on accept, something very exciting happens. You saw this commissions tab was grayed out previously. Once I hit on accept offer, it becomes a linkable submenu. So I can click on commissions and from within the commission submenu, you can see that the sales price, let me make sure that that's right. Um, the offer we accepted was 300,000. So let's go back into, well, let's change the response and accept. And there it goes. Now we're into the commission submenu. There it goes, now it updated. So you can see that the sales price, 300,000, my commission rate was 3%, my commission therefore is 9,000. This is one unit. Now, if I was taking this listing at a lower commission, I could change the commission rate here. Um, full payments, we could add notes. Basically, this document might start to look very similar to documents that we've utilized in the past, maybe something called a green sheet. So pretty exciting that this will be what's going to replace green sheets. So we'll be able to do all of this within command. Now this is not active yet. It's coming down the pipe, hopefully sooner than later. And yet it is important that we get in here and start playing with it. So um, you can see obviously the splits based upon associate royalty, company dollar, what that split is as well. And I imagine the MCA is gonna have control over that with regards to um, when and where and um, if we've capped or not. So I can put in my deductions for KW Cares, Kids Can, or the Bold Scholarship. And then you'll see over here on the right hand side, it's going to break it all down. So my total commission, how much I pay in royalty, company dollar, what's left to be paid to me as the agent, and then what gets cut to the actual office. So I imagine once all of this is filled out in the future, we'll have the ability to click on submit and that will literally be all we have to do with regards to the green sheet because everything is already being pulled in from KWLS and guess what? No more double entry. So double data entry has always been a pain point for a lot of us and I know that the labs team and Keller Williams is working really hard to eliminate that. So that's today's quick and easy day 21 command 66 day challenge is to play with those test offers that you had created and then go in and actually accept one and then take a look at what the commissions tab looks like so you can start seeing what the replacement for green sheets will be. Guys, I hope you're having a fantastic Friday morning that you have a Friday morning, wow. A fantastic Tuesday morning, sorry guys, and that you have a fantastic week planned ahead of you. As always, I will look forward to speaking with you in the morning. Take care.